Hello, everybody. I just want to let you know that Ijo matter matters me. And the reason why I am saying what I'm saying is because we just recently came back from a trip in Nigeria. We went to a few Ijo settlements and creeks. I also um, just returned from Minnesota where we had Ijo women of America. And I had a frantic call from my, one of my relatives. And he called me so urgently that I thought somebody had died. And what he asked me was, since when did you become an Ijo woman? And I was shocked and I told him to be quiet. I asked him, my last name is Abby and our settlement currently is Tombia. I said, do you know that we have a base in Ikbitiyama, Tombia, which is in Bayalta State? Do you know they're the same? Do you know that we have a base who are in Grand Bonnie Kingdom? Do you know that they're the same? Do you know that Elim Tombia has Simingi and Finima also has Simingi? Do you know that they are the same people? And the person was shocked. Then and only then did the person start to think, oh, this could be. So let me set the record stick straight. If you are Calabari, you are Krika, you are somewhat in that, they call it Eastern zone. We don't believe in zones because we are all one each other. If you are in that mind frame of asking, or inquiring a Nembe person asking if you are a job, I'm here to tell you that you are an Ijo person. Okay? You may disagree with me because your parents probably did not teach you this. We are one tribe. We, we were divided by the colonialists when they came. All our tribes flow from east to west or from west to east. They don't flow from north to south. And when the colonialists came, they divided us from north to south, leaving some of our relatives in different countries. There are job people in Senegal, there are job people in Gambia, there are job people in Sierra Leone, there is job people in the Congo, there is job people in Cameroon, there is job people in the Republic of Benin, there is job people in Ghana. Everywhere the Atlantic coast touches land, on the western side, there are Ijo people there. So when you, we are saying Ijo women or Ijo people, it encompasses all the Ijo tribes. Now, not only to talk about uh, 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 the entire western coast, in Nigeria alone, we are in seven different states. We divided it ourselves. So let's take in point the state that I come from, River State. River State was one state. By the time I knew, they've divided into two states. Now the two states, what did they do? Just like the colonialists from north to south. Bayelsa on one side, River State on one side. Why didn't they cut it in the middle from east to west so that you can have all the similar Ijaw speaking people in one state? For their benefit. For the benefit of division, for the benefit of con confusion, and for the benefit of disunity. And so what, we, what I am saying today is a message to all Ijo people. I'm calling on you to realize who you are. That if you understand both, Tobara, Emi, Indan, Loku, Indi, Oju, Smebra, Koide, if you understand Noah, Aloha, Mbana, you are an Ijo person. It does not matter what state that you belong to. The state was a division, a, a, a division made for personal gain. And we are here to say that unless we unite, unless we decide to be one, speak with one voice, we are going nowhere. We have a lot of challenges yet. Yes, we have a lot of struggles. You say struggles, but I, I, I don't believe in struggles. You know why? I don't believe that the sun struggles to shine, nor rivers struggle to flow, or your fingernail struggles to grow. Nothing in life struggles. And we will not struggle as Ijo people, God forbid. We are not in any struggle. We are here to show who we are to the universe, to tell our story. Every history book has stories of people, indigenous people, and where they are from. 
Ijo people, where is yours? And that is why I am saying that we must call on Ijo unity. Ijo unity first. It doesn't matter if you're from Lagos State. It doesn't matter if you're from Ondo, if you're from Edo, if you're from Bayelsa, Delta, River State, Aquaibom, wherever you may find your state as an Ijo person, it does not matter at all. Let us unite as one because when we are one, when we unite as one people, trust me, the whole world can only look in awe. That is my message to you. God bless you. It's Isantobo. Peace.